What is up, ladies and gents, and welcome back to Yes, No, Maybe So, the final part of South Park, the French butthole walkthrough. Did I say that right? Butthole walkthrough. There we go. All right. Now, before I start the video, we got a message from um, M Mysterio saying that all Freedom Pals need to report to, well, somewhere all the way up here. Yep. Over here. But before I ended the last video, we got a message from the school team. No, the church, dude. Saying we have to go do something. So we should go handle that right now. Or I, I kind of want to. I want to finish up. Well, try to finish up every single major side quest before, you know, we get to the end of Egger's glue. Huh. Going the complete opposite direction. Oh, well, this is new. Kid, over here. Do I want to talk to this guy? I've been watching you, and I believe we can help each other. Have you heard of the super best friends? Well, it is I, Seaman! A powerful superhero with the amazing ability to talk to fish and swim. It's Seaman! That Seaman! It is my job to help all creatures of the sea. And right now, there is a gay fish who wants help getting his mother into heaven. I want to help the little gay fish, but all the other super best friends keep saying they're too busy. Will you help? Then swim down to the water's depth with me. Don't worry, my water defenses shall protect you. And so, the new kid dives down through the water, protected by seamen. Seaman! Down to where the little gay fish makes his home. Boo-hoo-hoo. Oh, boo-hoo-hoo, boo-hoo, boo-hoo. Do not cry, little fish. I have returned and with help. Oh, thank you, Seaman. You really think you can help my mom get to heaven? It's Seaman, and yes, I do. This child has incredible powers. All right, if you get my mom into heaven, I will give you $3 million and some jewelry. Just touch my little gay flipper, and we shall be magically transported to help her. Touching the gay fish's flipper, Seaman and his sidekick are transported to Valhalla, where another fish rides a unicorn. I'm here, Mama. Is that you, baby? It's me. We're going to get you to heaven, Mama. Just hold on. This kid's going to help us. OK, baby, whatever you say, you little gay fish. And so, Seaman's sidekick had to help the gay fish's mom fly to heaven on a stream of rainbow unicorn farts. That's Seaman. And this road leads right to heaven, Ma. Watch out for those columns. If I'm not mistaken, this is Kanye West's game where you're trying to send uh, his mom to heaven. That's what it reminded me of. Oh, Kanye. But even Easy. as the gay fish's mom got closer to heaven, the path became more treacherous. Oh man, this has everything. Columns, fireballs, sparkly rainbows. It's genius. All right, that's not my fault. Why are you guys trying to go fast now? I'll just get to heaven quicker, baby. Oh. Oh god. I've seen shit like this before. You think this shit's regular? His fireballs are like the mean tweets people send at me because they don't understand my genius. This is so exciting. This is how I'm always gonna remember you, mama. A strider unicorn. You do that, you little gay fish. Wait, who is this dude? I made it! Thanks for your help, baby! I love you, mama! I'll see you soon, baby! Yep, I'll see you soon, ma- Wait, what the fuck is that supposed to mean? Mama! Hold on a sec. What is that? You have done very well, my child. Thank you, Jesus. Not you, Seaman. The kid. Seaman! Oh, yeah, right. Anyway, you had no reason to help this little gay fish, my child. And yet, you did. Kid had every reason to help me. I'm a lyrical genius voice of a generation. I see that you are trying to determine your spirituality, my child. Allow me to help thee. There are good and bad in every religion, my child. Which are you? Lawful. Neutral. Chaotic. Neutral. Lawful. Agnostic. Atheist. Buddhist, Christian, Jew, Mormon, Jew, Hindu, 
Christian. Okay, you're a lawful Christian. Oh wait, I bet you want a selfie with Jesus, right? Congratulations, my child. You know who you are now. You are one step closer to believing in yourself. Good luck, my little lawful Christian. Remember when there was only one set of footprints in the sand? That's because I got a rock in my sandal and had to sit down while you went on ahead. Well, well, well. Look at what we've got here. We've got ourselves a cisgender, heterosexual, black, American, lawful, Christian. Dang, Cletus, why are you talking like that? Dialogue tree. Oh, I got you. We don't take kindly to your types around here. Let's welcome this thing to our town. Yo, real talk, who wouldn't want a selfie with Jesus? That'd be Those awesome. American motherfuckers, now get the fuck out. My God's a vengeful God, and he told me to fuck you up. Good lord. Oh, say your prayers that to language. You say your prayers to. I got this 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 dude. I have no idea what I was going to call him though. Quit I have my no idea. Huh. He's done for. Now we're gonna play a video game and send you to heaven. I'm gonna teach you the gospel of kicking your ass. Racist. Batman, Arkham. Oh, I messed it up. You fucking believer of stuff different than me. <laughs> you ain't converting me to your slightly different beliefs. Tis the world we live in nowadays, of course. This might sting. Pounce drop. Turning the other cheek. Pouncing on you, partner. Retribution, but with inclusion. <laughs> Nicely done. Wait, so I already chose my religion. Oh, okay. Well, that was easy. I thought he was like in his church or something, like down this way. Guess I was wrong. Hey, it's the Kanye fish. I'm the Kid in town. All right, let's go fast pass. I was about to say speed racer, but that's the wrong character. Uh, awesome. Wait, is speed racer? Speed racer is the car. It's, it's not the person. Speed racer. Just there you a go. confusing. Yeah, what ifs? What up? That hurts, jerk. Oh, hi, little homie. It's me, Classy. I just wanted to thank your ass for taking down the corrupt police chief. I'm free now, thanks to you. Anytime you need help, you just call on Classy. With an eye and a little dick hanging off the eye, fucking the shit out of the ass. Nah, I'm good. <laughs> Head and run, queen. Thinking this is someone back here. No, it's the backpack. Which, a backpack I cannot reach. Well... Isn't this the time we call Dora the Explorer? Or there's Boots the Cat. No, not Boots the Cat. Boots the Monkey. And Swiper the Fox. Ah, it's destroyed. It's all gone, man. Timmy's franchise plan. All that work. It's barely even readable. It must have come in the night. Got past the security grid. Damn it. Who the hell would do this? I'll bet it was the sixth graders. Only they would stoop to this level. No, this was someone who wanted to hurt us personally. Yes, Siri. Incoming video message. Play the message, full screen. Oh, oh. What is this place? Hey, isn't that the new kid's parents? <laughs> this is a message to Coon and friends. 
Oh, God damn it. Looks like I had something that the new kid wants. That's good, because the new kid had something that I want. Connor, that son of a bitch! Care to make a trade, new kid? Let's make a deal. Hey, listen, you're gonna be in big trouble if you don't... He hit me! Did you see that? Get out there, and then do exactly as I say, new kid, or you will never see your parents again. And hurry, or else there'll be more of this. Where are they, fat ass? Where is who, human cat? The new kid's parents, where are they? How should I know? Because that's fucking you. You took the new kid's parents because you hate that we merged with Freedom Pals. That's not true. I want this mega franchise more than anybody. Tell him, Dad. You have five seconds, Cartman. I'm on your side. New kid, you believe me, don't you? Yeah. Oh, I'm out. I'll prove my innocence, you assholes. Come on, we gotta get that fat box. What'd he tell you? I, I, I'm confused. What did what did he do? Oh, he gave me all the powers. Oh, wow. Okay, I could definitely dig it, even though. Even though I probably won't change it because I do like the setup I have right now. <laughs> well, thanks, Timmy. All right, new kid. I'm gonna tell you where to go, and you're gonna go there on foot. No fast travel. You got that? The first one is easy. Go to the place where people get their copy fix. Better hurry. Tick tock, tick tock. To go get their coffee fixed. To get coffee shop. That's a, that's a weird way to say it, I guess. Is it? Did people say, "Hey, I'm gonna go to get my coffee fixed"? Huh. I don't know. Sorry, that really threw me for a loop. <laughs> Great, these dickety douches. Nobody. <laughs> oh. No, you don't. Wait, this will ever still following me. When you get to the location, you're gonna see a guy in a red shirt. Go talk to him. Hello, welcome to Tweet Coffee. What can I interest you in today? Oh, whoa! Isn't that the vigilante? I don't know if you're a hero or a menace. Man, this coffee really has me buzzed. Hello? It's for you. That's real good, new kid. But now I'm gonna make things a little harder on you. Instead of telling you where to go, I'm giving you a riddle. You ready? A place where death comes in all shapes and sizes. Go into this door to find what your prize is. Dude, I'm so wasted on this stuff. Okay, solve Connor's death store riddle. So, you think you kind of outsmart a shitty ninjas? Oh, don't think you can run from a shitty ninja. You see, shitty ninja always have a backup plan. You have made many enemies in this town, Vigilante. And now, you will have to face us all at the same time. Group leaders, take us out of my... Sixth graders! Boys and girls, assemble! They took our jobs! Crap oh, crap people. Ha <laughs> Vigilante! Everybody mad at you! Prepare to die! Uh... Wait, what? Sixth graders just wanted to look at boobs, and you killed them! Okay, Ninja, you watching? 
You guys are so interesting. Not like those losers we're beating up. Let me show you misfits how you get her done. All right, very well then. Y'all dug your own graves, just letting you know. Do not mess with a person who could do this. Ah, I thought you ninjas could turn into smoke and whatnot. No, nah, that's not authentic ninja move. Yeah. Uh, I liked his outfit. Eh, Ryu Hayabusa's is better. Human type, ready to swoop. My best friend's sister has an algebra class. Oh, I know this freaking uh, sixth grader. He's the one who did the Usher stuff. You don't get to go. Okay. Looks like crab. Join the people. <laughs> you know, for a crab person, you're pretty okay. Thank you, human spawn. It's the only way. Yeah. yeah! OMG, that was actually not bad. Goddamn right. Girls would freak if they saw who I was fighting with. Wholesale customer, I have savings for you. Yeah, their attack only fueled my rage. Prepare to meet your end. No mercy. Leave our friend alone, fiend. I'm going to. Uh... America. Love it or get your ass kicked, socialist. See that? Who needs ninja stars and crab claws? Ugh. You're up, ass blaster. Aw, oh, that crab guy was a cutie. Don't you dare ever mess with Team Beta ever again. Crap, people. Oh my goodness. Man, I gotta go find this freaking riddle. I totally forgot what it was. But Lord, it's me, buddy. A place where death comes in all shapes and sizes? What, what could it mean? We've got to solve this riddle. Take down Connor together and prove our innocence. And hey. Thanks for being the only one who believes in me. Hey, new kid. I've been following what's going on. I'm trying to pinpoint Cartman's location. For now, just do what he says so he doesn't get suspicious. <laughs> Cartman really is the one who's doing this, huh? What a psycho. I'm guessing he means go to the gun store. Freedom pals, this is Super Craig. No sign of Cartman at the park. No sign of Cartman at Raisins either. Mosquito, stay on point. Get out of there. How could you? You're working from an old model. I'm an original. You. So you stalked my riddle, huh? You're not as dumb as I thought. You see the guy standing over there? Take a selfie with him. Do it now. Your mom is gonna suffer.
Crime fighting's not a game, vigilante. You're gonna get somebody killed. You're getting close, new kid. But to find me, you're gonna have to solve one more riddle. I am a place where seats hang from chains. Part desert, part jungle, where happiness reigns. I totally guessed the freaking gun store thing. I guess he's talking about the park. Alright, it's worth a shot. Yo, get your ninjutsu stuff out of here, man. I'm trying to solve a riddle. This is life or death. Well, nothing that serious, but you know. Wait, he said sand. This is just snow. Oh no, what do I do? Well, of course, it's the park. It's the only where things that has the, the something. I don't know. I just totally said that backwards. Well, you guys know what I mean. How did you solve my riddle? God, you're so smart. Wow, I'm so jelly. All right, you see that woman there? Go talk to her. He, he told me if I didn't do what he said, he'd do horrible things to my patio. Get a selfie with her. Do it now. I'm sorry. He, he said he would poop on my patio. What was I supposed to do? He, we just cleaned our patio. I had to do what he said. <laughs> that should just about do it. Sorry, kid. I have what I need now. See you around. New kid, I got him. All of his messaging has been coming from the community center. You heard her, Freedom Pals! Everyone get to the community center now! Where's everyone else? Doesn't matter. There's no time. Let's get this fat turd while we can. All right, one, two, three! <gasps> oh my god, look! Well, well, well. If it isn't the Freedom Pals and their newest recruit. What have you done with the new kid's parents, fat ass? Nothing yet. But when I'm finished with you, I can't say they'll be exactly safe. This has gone far enough. We end it now. The only thing about to end is you, Mysterion. We aren't gonna fight you, Carmen. Now put your stupid hand down and stop playing games. We have to stop him, you guys. He's got all the new kid's followers now. Even with their help, you can't stop me, King. We'll see about that, motherfucker. All right, Cartman. You want us to kill Mitch Connor? We'll fucking kill him! <laughs> we can stop Mitch Connor, guys! Just try not to hit me! Oh man, I want, I've been wanting to slap the shit out of you for a while, Carmen. No offense. You know how it is. New kid, I thought you were on my side. <laughs> Even the new kid has turned his back on you, Keen. Take place of that me. Ugh. Your coon friends don't seem very friendly towards you now, Keen. Just shut up, Connor. Damn it, coon, quit fooling around. I'm just an innocent hostage here. Stop before I break your fucking hand. Not if I break you first, Mysterion, which I will. Anyone can be mayor if they just work hard enough. Ow. Guys, I'm really sorry about this. Mitch is such an asshole, huh? If it's a story, he's really sticking to it. Have you no honor, villain? You got this, butthole! Figure out I'm on your side yet? Guys, I just don't know who to believe. Really? Because it seems pretty fucking obvious. We know you're not really hostage of your own hand, asshole. Oh yeah, blame the victim. Real cool, guys. Oof. Just look at the loyalty you inspire in your former comrades. You're the one being a dick to them. Hey, that was me. Watch the friendly fire. I have a really good feeling about this, guys.
You don't get to go. Now you're gonna get it. Oh, Black Lord, douchebag, new kid. I swear, I I'm just an innocent hot. After further calculation, that damage didn't happen. You cheating asshole! Diabetes time. Not sure if you know, but hell hath no fury like Wrath of Fight. Oof! Damn it! I didn't kidnap Butlard's parents. Bullshit! Make way for Mysterion. Muscular body makes the most effective human shield, Kuhn. I am known for my super strength, son of a bitch. Prepare for cooning. Ah. Oh. How does it feel having your friend's blood on your hands, Kuhn? Yo, oh, and you're on fire now. And now your movement is reduced, okay? Better hurry. Retribution, but with inclusion. Wow, you did it, guys. You beat Mitch Connor. Kids' parents. <laughs> You'll never know. I don't know. Shit, he's gone. Come on, we're taking this fat piece of shit back to base. What fat piece of shit, human cat? The only way we're going to get Carmen to talk is to torture him. Yeah, sometimes torture is the only answer. You're gonna torture me for what? Everyone, get back to Freedom Pal's base. We have to make this shithead talk. What are you talking about, guys? It's me, the King. What the? What is wrong with you guys? I am not your enemy! You're gonna talk, Cartman. New kid, you're going to have to make Cartman talk. What? What are you gonna do with that? You guys are wasting your time. I'm the Coon. Torture doesn't work against me, remember? So, so what? I, I just have to watch you eat? Is that it? I'm, I'm not afraid. That asparagus is sure gonna make your fart smell bad. See, it, it doesn't even phase me. Is that a cuttlefish? Oh, no, I, I prefer salmon myself. No, not, not, no, not even a little bit. I can gobble those farts up, see? Yum, 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 yum. Broccoli? I, I'm not afraid of broccoli. It gets a bad rap, if you ask me. Oh, no, 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 no. No, those parts don't bother me at all. Hit him again. Oh, jeez. Well, I, I guess we're done here, huh? Can someone reach around and get this knot? You're not gonna eat that chili dog, are you? That's not chili on top. Oh, now that's pretty gross, you guys. Oh, God. Yeah, you guys might as well give up. They're not the... <coughs> oh, no. oh, oh, wait, 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 you guys. Oh, my God. Oh, the, the cats. What cats? I just remembered. Connor. I think the, the fudge jarred my memory. The, he said something about making cats more powerful. That, the, the, yeah, that's it. He must, he must want to genetically alter the cats. The genetics lab. Dr. Mephesto. Yes, that must be it, guys. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I agree, Genex Lab. I have no clue where that is, but we'll find it. Festo's Genex Lab. Yep. Okay, my eye just got watery and itchy. Alright, this might be the final battle. We gotta get we gotta get a god. 
in my head, I was like, this is going to be the final battle. We got to get ready. For some reason, what came out of my mouth was, well, actually, no. I meant to say that backwards. What, what I said in my head was, it's the final battle. We need to get bone ready. That didn't make sense. But I said we need to get ready. Eh, whatever. I got it right. The new kid's here. Come on, new kid. Can I help you? Yeah, hi. We signed up for the tour. Ah, uh, yes, the night tour, correct? Uh, yeah, we're a little early. Well, I'm afraid for safety purposes, the tours are only offered from 10 p.m. to midnight. What, just to be extra spooky? It'll be worth the wait, my friends. See you tonight. Shit. Well, now what do we do? We'll just have to wait. We can't afford to let anyone else go in or out of this gate. I agree. We're just gonna have to wait here till nighttime. Okay, how far away is that? Uh, about six hours. All right, just wait six hours and we're good to go. How long now? Still about six hours. Okay, cool. This sure is gonna be exciting in six hours. Shut up, Scott. Did anybody bring any uh, snacks or anything? Yeah, we should have brought snacks. Oh, God, okay, how long now? Right around six hours still. Jesus, fuck. You know, kid, you still have yet to tap the full potential of your time-bending ass. 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 Something that could enhance your ability could possibly make time pass more quickly. 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 You see that AC fan over there? Right there, behind you. Over by the gate. On the left side. Can't miss it. If you part into that fan, the oscillation of the gas will filter it through the expansion valve, mixing it with the pressurized refrigerant inside the condenser coils. 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 Don't question if that makes any sense, kid. Just part in the fan. Go on. I'll fire it up for you right now. Some young people interested in genetic engineering, huh? Wonderful, please come in. Oh, hello. Oh, there's more. Hello, sir. My, my, there's a lot of you. Timmy! Well, I'm so pleased that you children are interested in genetic engineering. Genetic science began as a simple question. Can a monkey be made to have four asses instead of one? The answer was yes. And now we've been able to give more asses to pigs, horses, everything you can imagine. Yes, little boy. How does that help? Oh, you're one of the cynics, huh? Well, meet me over here for the tour and I'll show you how. Come on, don't be shy. We don't want to miss the four ass gorilla feeding. Please have a seat. You ever play that video game Half-Life? Okay, here we go. Here you can see our greenhouse. Genetic engineering is helpful to grow larger tomatoes, onions, cucumbers. Fruits and vegetables with more asses means more nutrition for people all around the planet. What good does that do? Oh, you Bible thumpers are all alike. Don't play God, you'll pay for it. <laughs> Let's continue up to the second level, shall we? Uh, 
Another benefit of genetic science, of course, is combining animals. Like these donkey apes, bunny fish, squirrel donkeys, and more. Once we put more asses on these, we will truly be benefiting science. Will you please explain how that benefits science at all? What's your name, little boy? Super Craig. You see, Super Craig, once we know how to do things to animals, we can hopefully apply them to mankind. You think having more asses is impossible? I tell you it's not. You see, genetic engineering is not just for animals and veggies. We are working towards helping people as well. Here you can see genetic mutations of my dead son. Most people don't remember that I once had a young child named Terrence. Oh yeah, I remember that kid. I was wondering whatever happened to him. Terrence was killed tragically in town when some kids were playing around with a relic belonging to Barbara Streisand. Oh, jeez, I think that was us. So, you're doing this all as a way to bring back your dead son? Bring him back? Well, of course not. I'm trying to give his dead body more asses so he can finally rest in peace. Now let's continue on to the fourth floor. Oh, fuck. Well, here we are. The top floor of the building and the end of our tour. What are these? These horrible, monstrous mistakes of science. Our new benefactor has asked that we genetically alter some of the local sixth graders and make them stronger and crazier. Okay, okay. Why the fuck would you do that? How do you mean? Why the fuck? Would you make genetically enhanced sixth graders? Calm down, Super Craig. How do you think we pay for all this? We have financial donors. Our latest benefactor has asked for this army of mutated sixth graders to protect his altered cats. What altered cats? Oh, right over this way. A wealthy benefactor named Mr. Connor has donated money to have stray cats enhanced with more asses. Our company can add asses to things at very competitive rates. The problem is that cats seem to become really aggressive when given more asses. They've proven to be quite deadly. Then why would you bring a bunch of kids up here? Look, there's nothing to worry about. This entire facility has a very complex security grid. Huh, that's never happened before. Oh shit, someone shut down the security grid. What do you mean? <laughs> Hello, Freedom Pals. What are you doing, fat ass? So, you figured out my little plan, huh, Freedom Pal? Think you can stop me? Oh, I have someone here who'd like to say hello, new kid. Go on, talk. Guys? Guys, it's me, the kid. Will you knock it off? Listen to me. Don't make any deals with this piece of garbage. He's an animal. Ah! That's enough out of you, kid. You've been a real pain in my ass, new kid. You should have known not to mess with Mitch Connor. Where the fuck are you? Mr. Connor, if you shut down the security grid, then everyone in this building is going to die. What? Sorry, Doc. Sometimes sacrifices have to be made for the greater good of the city. So long, Freedom Pals. Mini ass cats, okay. All right then, let's begin. Today is the last day of the rest of your life. I'm sorry, kids, but we're probably all going to die here. You okay, Mysterion? Oh, man, we ain't dying we today. I think a kitty is on the move. Give him hell, douchebag. I got this. Dunzo. Pinnacle damage. My favorite. I will defeat you. All right. Who's next? Come on, let's go. I could do this all day. Watch out for their claws and butts. We, oh. oh my God! That's a nasty ass hairball. Feel the wrath of human kite. Buzz, buzz, B. Nope, wrong person. Zap. I might say zap. I'd love to hear more about that heat vision of your human kite. Uh, sure, I can tell you all about it someday. See that guy? Human kite and Captain Guy are like best friends now. Note the pupil dilation and increased salivary response. Those four ass cats are getting quite pissed off now. Oh man, we, we really don't need more ass cats. Subjects. Brace yourselves for cat attack. When is too when is too much ass? Some might say. Aquarium, why is that even a button? Oh lord. Sometimes 
but it's too much ass is a bad thing. Case in point. I feel I should mention that my test subjects have a crazed hunger yeah, for humans. These little guys aren't messing around, super friends. I'm all thumbs today. I assume you've all had your Tdap vaccination. I really should make that a request. Wow. Nice one, you kid. Captain Diabetes is back in action. Yeah. Wow. Oh wow, you see what I just did, guys? Yes, Captain, we saw it. that villain. I'm not your worst nightmare. I aspire to be. I definitely should not have hit that button. You lose. Got some new ones. Actually, nope, just took one out of my other controller. Still works. Level 10. My poor creatures. We must escape the lab. Maybe. Maybe we can go through some of the larger exhibits. This way, children. No. Maybe if I just press buttons randomly? Mutant sixth graders are on the loose. This was definitely not supposed to happen. Ugh, school's so dumb. Parents are dumb. Yeah, adults are stupid. Oh, Jesus. It's okay. We'll be safe in the tour tram. Oh, the tour tram is offline. Somebody's going to have to get to the CPU and hit the override switch. Where's the CPU? Down on the third level. Oh, it was silly to put it there, wasn't it? So somebody has to walk down to the third level and flip the switch? One, two, three. Not it. Not it. Not it. Not it. Not it. Nah. <laughs> not it. Sorry, new kid, but it really should be you anyway. Yeah, if you think about it, this is all kind of your fault. Okay. Our school's Wait, dumb. what the heck? Oh my god, that is gross. Here, little 
little minion. There you go. Great warrior, we will meet again. Access the stairs. Get down to the. Okay, you should be coming to my dead son now. Just keep heading west. Yeah. <laughs> oh, look at the little fourthy. Come here, dork. Hey, Jasper. Get over here, deed. There's a picture of some boobs, man. Boobs? Oh, I want to see some boobs. Where? Little guy, in you go. Hey, Jasper, you got the wrong one. Good luck fixing that dream so we can all live. School is for single ass homos. Pick some asses. Holy shit, those weren't on the tour. If nothing else, beating on you guys is really therapeutic for me. <laughs> you like that, Forthy? Got a lot more waiting for you in middle school. <laughs> Your attack only fuel my rage. I'm counting on you, partner. We got these guys. For Forthy Scum, you guys are kind of scrappy. Yeah. I'm going through a lot of stuff right now, and needing to punch you was one of them. Ah. I'll wipe my asses with you, Forthies. These guys look like they want to push us around. Let's push them back. I'm not your worst nightmare, I aspire to be.
stupid little fourthies? Show no weakness. Come here, twerp. Man, how many mutant animals are in this place? I'm gonna flush you, Forthies. My time. Let's pound these pussies. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That's it. He's cleared the way. The CPU should be right through that door, kid. We'll come down and join you. Thank God! You've got to stop him! He's out of his mind! Cartman, you fucking asshole! What are you doing? Connor brought me here, human cat. The sick son of a bitch- uh, You shut up, Coon. Soon this town will be rid of you and all the Coon friends. We're freedom pals, fat ass. We know what you're doing, Eric. Putting cat urine into people's drugs and alcohol to make them crazy. We want to know why. Yeah, why, you sick piece of- uh, Do I really have to spell it out, Coon? This city is sick. We both know it. There's only one time of year when this town is the way it should be. On Christmas! So I join the Chamber of Commerce, and use them to unleash my master plan. 
Escalate crime in the city, blame crime on mayor, run for mayor, get tons of followers, clone new kid into a genetic mutant, win election, make every day Christmas. What do you think? Pretty sweet plan, right? Dude, quick! Take a selfie! I spent a lot of time working on this, this plan. It's almost a shame that no one will ever know how perfectly my plan worked. Dude, you've gone too far this time. Nobody's gonna let you be mayor. Oh no, I've got all the new kids' followers. Every last one of them is now following me. Gee, that was smart. Eric, I know that Christmas every day sounds like fun, but it really wouldn't be. Fuck you, Dr. Timothy. If you guys don't mind, I've got an election to win. No, no, no. God damn it. Well, there goes the main CPU. Darn it, why did I put that thing on a mobilized trap door? Why wouldn't you? I'm afraid now someone will have to go clear to the ground level and call for the tour tram from there. All right, fine. Hurry up, new kid. We gotta get out of here. Yeah, new kid. Stop wasting time. It's okay, Mosquito. We're not going to die in here. We will survive. <laughs> Hmm. Your ass is awesome, dude. 